What's going on guys, Ness here. And what if I told you that you could have the ultimate retro gaming console, as well as a fantastic media streaming device, all for $5? You think I was pretty crazy, huh? Huh? Well, it's true, it's 100% true with this wonderful little device right here. What I'm holding in my hands is the Raspberry Pi Zero. For those of you who don't know, the Raspberry Pi Zero is a single board containing a 1 GHz processor as well as 512 megabytes of RAM, basically making it a fully functioning tiny computer. The thing has HDMI output and one micro USB port, the second USB port being the system's power supply. The thing loads a slew of operating systems all rooted in Linux off of the micro SD card slot over there on the side. The OS that I have this Pi running is a custom operating system called RetroPie which is stocked with a ton of emulation software from all of your retro consoles. Everything from NES to handhelds like Game Boy, Game Boy Advanced, SNES, Sega Genesis, and even Nintendo 64 will work, with a little bit of overclocking and some setting tweaks. And what if you're saying to yourself, but Ness, I'm not a gamer. How can this thing serve me? Well, Raspberry Pi still got you covered by supporting a fully functioning Kodi. For those who don't know, Kodi is a media streaming platform for all of your movies, TV shows, and even live TV needs. So not only can this thing become the ultimate retro gaming console that you've been needing, it also has the potential to maybe replace your cable bill off for five bucks that's absolutely insane now the catch is these things are pretty high in demand so they're a little bit hard to come by i was fortunate enough to find mine at a micro center store but if you do a little bit of digging i'm sure you could find one of these if not there's a multitude of single board computers that are capable of doing the exact same thing i freaking love this thing i use the heck out of it and i know you guys will too till next time this is ness Signing out.